All right. Hey guys, this is Mystic. This is my first ever playthrough of a game called The Stanley Parable. I know nothing of this game at all, except of, besides the fact that there is a narrator and he's funny. That's it. This game was on sale for the winter sale and I decided to pick it up. Let's get on it. So I was told that this game was a mind fuck, and I'm going in blind, or not blind, I do know something, but that's about it. What I've said is just about all I know. So let's see how this game is, and it's actually taking a while to load. I'm going to skip ahead until it's done. This is the story of a man named Stanley. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on the keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor on his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. And although others might have considered it soul-winning, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley was happy. And then one day, something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour, when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened, this complete isolation. Something was very clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. I guess I have control now. So, okay. Uh, all right, all right then. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Oh, well, you're not wrong. Let's see what's over here. Is it just empty? They're open doors, so I'm gonna go there soon. They're like, I hate Mondays. These controls are actually weird. Well, wait. The controls are actually weird. Let me fix the mouse sensitivity real quick. All right, there it is. That's much better. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Uh, hmm. Can I see anything? Well, fuck you. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. <laughs> okay. Alright. Well, is this the employee lounge? That fucking concrete wall is really weird. That is not... that is not normal. Ah, yes. Truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all just to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. Yes, okay, yeah, I guess this is a... Uh... Yes, really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating that even though all your co-workers have mysteriously vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paintings. Really There's paintings. Oh, there are paintings! Hey, this narrator's a cunt. How does he talk like that? Just At this point, Stanley's obsession with this room bordered on creepy and reflected poorly on his overall personality. 
Well, it's fuck possible you. That this is why, but at last, he'd had enough of the amazing room and took the first open door on his left to get back to business. Should have stayed in there, actually. I really want to know what he was talking about. I have a decision to make. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Fuck this guy. I really hope I didn't do something wrong. But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. So now in order to get back, he needed to go, um, uh, from here, it's, um, left. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh, no. What the oh, fuck? to the right, my mistake. Asshole. You better not fucking... Like, open some other... You better not open that door, you little shit. No, oh my no, god. Not the right. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? What was I thinking? It's clearly... Oh dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? Oh my god. Now, let's see. We went down right, left, down, left, right. Yep, yeah, yep. Okay, okay, yes. I've got it now. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. There's nothing there. Oh, yeah, there is. Okay. <laughs> you fucking asshole. No, 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 no. This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. Quick, Stanley, close your eyes. Okay. Eh, okay, eh, okay no, just, not supposed to see. To, um, oh. oh, but it's so interesting. It's all this? rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, We'll just restart the game from the beginning. What? And this time, suppose we don't wander so far off track, hmm? Okay. From the top. Oh my god. Really? You're gonna load me in like that? Oh my... You actually started me over. You little shit. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Is there something different? Like, is there something I can catch? When Stanley, wait, wait, what? No, I'm... no, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted the game over, completely fresh. Everything should be. Oh, did something change? Stanley, did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? No. Did you move the story somewhere or? Uh... Hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Okay then. It's an adventure. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. <laughs> okay. All right, then. Oh, this door. Wait, were these doors open? Ooh, I want to go there. I can't jump. Okay. Well, okay, I know it's there. Let's go this way. This is a... I hope not a dead end. Hmm. Oh, what the fuck? Dark areas are fun. I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was a story here before. Do we just... Do we need to restart the game again? No. Well, I find it unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting over and over again. But it's got to be better than this. Wait, 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 okay, wait. Okay, let's give it a shot. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Oh, my God. There was a loop. That was a loop. He took me on a loop. I swear to God, that was a loop. The chairs were right there. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. That was a loop. I swear to God, that was a loop. I'm, I'm 100... Okay, yep. It's worse. What? I might be remembering this wrong. It's Look, possible the story chairs. is back where we just came from. Why don't we go back the other direction and see if we missed anything? Oh my god. Dude, look. Like, so I went through here. No, here. I went through here. And then it, I went all. 
and then, and then these chairs were here, and there was a big room. I swear to God, there was. Let's see. Was that always there? Aha! I knew we'd miss something. The story. Here it comes. Oh my God! Wait. No, wait. Never wait. mind. Not the story. Okay, let's head back the other way and retrace our steps. This was a loop again. No, no, wait, what? No, 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 no. This doesn't make sense. Does it? Wait. Yeah. So it cuts off right there, and then that. Would, okay. Okay. So I'm not crazy. There, there's got to be stairs, right? It's not just a door. Okay, this doesn't make sense. Okay. Okay. Now this, well, I'll be honest, I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? I don't think so. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. It, is that correct? Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? No. Would well, you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? You win! Congratulations! What? No, 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 no. I paid money for this. And it really paid off. So, good job. Oh, no. No, I don't feel right about this at all. We both know you didn't put in any actual work for that win. Some people win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. Okay? I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I don't care what might happen this time. I have to restart. Oh my god. So, I didn't want to talk over him, but there the door was gone. Oh. So, so the, all the wood was there. I went back and the door was gone. I didn't want to talk over him. And, fuck it, whatever. Let's all just right, go. I've got a solution. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Just follow the line. How simple is that? <laughs> oh, don't tempt me. Ah, fuck it, okay. God, but do I really want to fall? Okay, whatever, whatever. You see? The line knows where the story is. It's over in this direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. Though, here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Or to put it another way, is the story of no destination still a story simply by the act of moving forward are we implying a journey such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. shut up <laughs> a bit weird back there well i'd like to apologize not sure where i was going with all that you know what i think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood oh hell yeah Okay, this is getting old. Wait. What? Wait. What? Wait, 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 wait. I'm confused. Wait. Cut the music. Go back and look at that fern. <laughs> Stanley, this fern will be very important later in the story. Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. You won't want to miss anything. Mm, yes, yes. This fern's pretty hot. Is, can I can I go? Okay, I'm gonna go. Wait, what we're back at the office? No. No, no, line. You do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The story? Is any of this ringing a bell? Wait, 
Where am I supposed to go? Okay, okay. So, I came in from here. I just came out. Oh, I went through this door and now I'm coming out. So, okay. I'll just keep following. Really? Again? Really oh, here? No, 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 not again, Line. How could you have done this to us? And after we trusted you, after everything we've been through, you. No, oh, I can't take this anymore. To hell with it. Restart. Oh my god. Okay. You know what, Stanley? I say forget the adventure line. What's it ever done for us? We're intelligent people, right? Why can't we make up our own story? Something exciting, daring, mysterious. All. This all sounds perfectly doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in, well, I don't know. How about this direction? Over here, huh? He's right, that line didn't do jack shit. Now, yes, this is exciting. Just me and Stanley <laughs> forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you want our story to be? Oh, this Go is a wild. fucking... Use your imagination. Whatever it might be, Stanley. What? I'm ready for it. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Ah, this game is fucking weird. Oh, no, not you again. Stanley, I'd also like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story. No lines or monitor rooms. Just Agreed. Just don't acknowledge it, and we should be fine. <laughs> you sound so sad. It's like the stupid-ass line's trying... Oh, my. It's a very strong line. Ah, a choice. We get to make a decision. From here, the story is in our control. How important we mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay. Are so I serious? know that each door has to lead somewhere, which means that somewhere at the place where we're trying to go, there must be a reverse door that leads here. And that, in turn, means that our destination corresponds with the counter-inverted reverse door's origin. So starting from the right, let us ask, will taking the right door lead us to where we're going? And since the answer is clearly yes, then by all accounts, the door on the right is the correct one. Another victory for logic. Come, Stanley. Our destiny awaits. That was fucking stupid. What it... Okay, so what you basically said is the right door takes us to our destination, but it can also take us back? No, no, I don't know. But why doesn't the left door take us there? Is there like, is it like a cartoon or it's just a brick wall right here? Fucking, okay, whatever. Well, this doesn't look like a good choice. Look at this shit. What the fuck? Eh, whatever. Oh, oh my god. Hmm. The confusion ending. You're telling me that's what this is? It's all one giant ending? And we're supposed to restart the game what, eight, eight times? That's really how all this goes? It's all determined? So now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just supposed to forget? Well, what if I don't want to forget? My mind goes blank simply because it's written here on this, this thing, wall. Well, who consulted me? Why don't I get to decide? Why don't I get a say in all of this? Is it really... No, it oh, can't that... be. I, I don't want eight. it to be. I, I don't want the game to keep restarting. I, I don't want to forget what's going on. I don't want to be trapped like this. I won't restart the game. I won't do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. So and the timer oh god. Stopped? Does that mean um, did we do it? Did we break the cycle? The um whatever it is that made this schedule? How would we even know? Will someone come for us? Will something happen? So okay. I guess now we just wait, you know, 
I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story, wouldn't you agree? I'm not oh quite sure God. if we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always saying that life is about the journey and not the destination. So I hope that's where we are right now. It's a pretty boring we'll ass journey. Out, we? I'm gonna fucking sit here. Well, in the meantime. What? Straight up in it and we feeling lifted a week. Going to get it so we feeling living so we zone into the morning every time we get up on it.